and hey everybody, welcome for more Indivisible. Actually, been a little bit since I last played. I um... Tail, I'm gonna hit you with an axe. That's right. Hmm. Okay. Okay. There we are. See, see what I did there. There we go. So now, now, no. Nope, all right, let's try going back this way. <laughs> There we go. Ha ha ha! So we're playing individual. Ajna. Good old Ajna. She's a wonderful little lady. Hey, guy. Hey, doggo. Buddy, you're doing okay. She was doing okay. She was doing fine, I assure you. My defense holds. See? Fine. Well, see? Totally fine. Now that's five of the magical stony bajigs. Mm -hmm. We know how I do love my stony bajigs. Wee. One doggo left. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I got my levels up. I still wonder what those heart levels are for. Hey, Mr. Tail. Just how long is this thing? I don't know. Judging by its diameter, I'd say it's quite long. That's science. Uh, but also, you know, we've only been encountering limited sections of it, and there's a background. It might doesn't. It, it could be smaller than we think. That wizard is growing concerned, though. Deeply concerned. Hmm. Oh. Let's try going up. This appears to be a way to go. Yeah, haven't been this way yet. Hmm. Hmm. Was that the way I wanted to go? I mean, maybe, but maybe not. Sure is a maze. I feel like this is the the correct way to go if I want to leave. or advance the plot, I suppose. So let's not. I was like, why well, isn't, isn't that button? But it was not. It was not the button I thought it was. I mean, that is quite the power slide. I mean, look at her expression as she does that. She's like, eh, whatever. Whatever. If I approach from this angle... Yeah. See? Yeah! And I got a red thingamajigger. Like at some point in the game, I've got to get the ability to, to, to fast travel to places I've been before. Nope. Oops! Ow! My limbs! I need my limbs. Mm -hmm. 
back up here. Okay. Now we're outside. <laughs> Encountering only the grumpiest tail parts. that thing there. Surely at some point... Wizard? Oh. What just happened? It sounded different that time. I think it's retreating to its lair. Its lair of that evil. We are to get out of here. <laughs> Let's drop a save. Giant face in the background. Die. Hey, Mr. Wizard. Hey, that's a bit rude. Oont. I didn't know that come. He's a bit of a grump, isn't he? I activate my super healing again. Kind of want to heal. Oh, well, let's punch him again. Focus. There we are. A little healing for the group. Oh. 
That's just cheating. Almost got him though. I'm doing okay. It's just a little bit of healing for the party. Just charge him. Yay! We killed the evil wizard, everybody. Sometimes. He's really trying to summon that, that serpent of his. Oh, he got chomped. No, we can't, Razmi. Why do you like sandworms so much? They remind me of my youth. Huh. That needs context. <sighs> Kadira, what's wrong? I just hope my brother is okay. Thanks to you and your friends, I'm finally going to face the Iron Kingdom. Oh, well, I kind of know how you feel. My dad just died. Dar killed him. Dar did? You did! How could you? It was... I, I was under orders. <laughs> a fine excuse. Ravanovar raised me since I was a child. I didn't... I, I didn't know. Frankly, I don't know how you can all stand each other. Break it up, children. I'll not have you fighting until we reach the port. <laughs> oh, Zebe. Adira, don't He's worry. so grumpy. We'll figure this out together. Just because we unleashed the destroyer. I guess we go this way. But what? Hold on, what if I went this way? Yeah. Right. Yeah, there's gonna be there's gonna be some point where I can do something with that. I can sense it in my sensing organs. You know the ones. You know the ones. Or we'll get a double jump. I predict it. Oh, definitely out of the desert. This seems nicer. A little bit of water, some life going on. And a big old city. Excellent. Oops, that's not the one I want. Well, Say anything different to me these days, Dar? Nope. Right. Oh. Port Merif Merifa. Yeah, it's people. Here it is, Port Merifa, the gateway to the world. Huh, for a gateway, I thought it would be bigger. We can get ships here, that's the main thing. Right, about that. What does everyone want to do? I dragged you into all this and- By sucking you into my brain! 
It's okay, Zebe. I appreciate everyone's help, but we're through the sandstorm now. None of you have to stay. But I need to figure out what this Kala thing means. Find out about my own power. I... I don't even know all the stuff I need to figure out. Ajna, you are the grossest, most disgusting person I've ever met in my well, life. That's a compliment coming Everything from Mazmi. you turns into a disaster. I... I guess you're right. So, obviously, I'm coming with you. Bomb is too. He has to come because he's mostly dead. <laughs> Aren't you, you little idiot? Oh, thanks, Razmi. Right? Am I thanking you after that? Of course. Whatever floats your boat, buddy. You saved me in the desert. You said you'd help me find out what happened to my brother. I'm coming. Yeah. <laughs> but you leave me alone, Razmi. No lips. <laughs> well, this is a lot more dangerous than I expected, but you can't become a world famous botanist without some risk. So, I'm coming. As am I. You still haven't fully recovered, and you need a guide as your power grows. And someone to buy you cute dresses and do your hair. What's wrong with my hair? Oh, absolutely nothing. Just for fun. Didn't your mother ever fix your hair? I. I didn't really know my mother. No. <gasps> no. Well, an Almushan braid would look lovely for starters. Do you have enough hair uh, for a braid? Well, thanks everyone. I really appreciate your help. Oh, but Zebe? Right. I want no further part in destroying the world, thanks. I've done enough to help the charade. Mm. I'm with He's you a little bit grumpy about place. things. Well, where a protector goes, so too must I. I understand. I'll make sure everyone who wants to stay finds a boat. How's that? Fine by me. Wait, may I speak? Better make it good. This is the big who stays and who goes conversation. And I'd prefer that you go. I know. I know most of you don't like me. And you have good reason. I did kill Ajna's father. I thought I was doing it for the good of the world. But Ravanovar had blinded me. He raised me since I was a boy. And yeah, childhood so indoctrination, everybody. I had no idea he meant to destroy it first. And I had no idea the deeds, acts we committed were done in the name of destruction. How did you not know killing innocent people was wrong? I was told they were blasphemers against the gods. But in truth, I have no excuse but youth. And yet, you are younger than I, and committed no such atrocities. Ravanovar told me the heretics we dispatched would be reincarnated in paradise, and live a better life. But I had never stayed behind after a battle. I'd never had to see the consequences until now. Apologizing isn't enough. I took someone precious to you, and I can never bring him back. Please, Ajna, let me offer my services to you as penance. You don't have to like me. I don't. But let me be your sword. I have no purpose. I have nowhere to belong. Please, I don't want to become some mercenary for hire. I know I'm asking even more of you, but I want to try to do something good. Let me help you save this world from destruction. It's not a bad speech. Well, don't do it. He's the worst. Yeah, he is, but... Maybe he deserves a chance. For what it's worth, he is being sincere. I'm... I'm gonna consider it. But listen, Dar. From now on, you're listening to me. And if we find someone who needs help, we're helping them. No discussion. I am yours to command. I will not complain. And... Thank you. This conversation got weird. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. I still like Razmi. Let's get going. And thanks again, everybody. All right. We're going to take a little break here, and then we're going to explore this port. Should be fun. There's lots of interesting people. Like this lady with the abs. Let's talk to her first. Next time.